eight signs you have a fatty liver. A fatty liver, also known as hepatic steatosis, occurs when too much fat builds up in liver cells. This condition can be very dangerous if not treated early. Fatty liver can lead to liver inflammation, liver damage, and even liver failure. According to the American Liver Foundation, over 100 million people in the United States alone have non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. Worldwide, it's estimated that about 25% of the population has NAFLD. The condition is often silent, meaning it doesn't always show symptoms right away, but when symptoms do appear, it's crucial to recognize them early. Fatty liver disease progresses through four stages. One, simple fatty liver steatosis. Two, non-alcoholic steatohepatitis, NASH. Three, fibrosis. Four, cirrhosis. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And let's dive into the eight signs you might have a fatty liver. One, right shoulder pain. Experiencing pain in your right shoulder could be linked to your liver. This happens because the liver is located in the upper right part of your abdomen and pain can radiate to your shoulder. This pain is often dull and persistent, making everyday activities uncomfortable. If you find that you're frequently rubbing or favoring your right shoulder due to discomfort, it might be time to consider a liver checkup. Two, belly fat. Excess fat around your abdomen or belly fat is a common sign of fatty liver. This type of fat, known as visceral fat, can accumulate around your liver and other organs, putting extra strain on your liver. It's not just a cosmetic concern, Belly fat is a serious health risk. If you notice your waistline expanding despite maintaining a healthy diet and exercise routine, it could be a signal that your liver is storing too much fat. Three, rib pain. Pain under your right rib cage can be a sign of liver issues. This pain might feel sharp or achy and can worsen after eating a fatty meal. The discomfort is caused by the liver becoming enlarged and pressing against the rib cage. If this pain becomes persistent or severe, it's important to consult a doctor, as it could indicate that your liver is struggling to function properly. Four, spider veins. Spider veins, small red spider-like veins visible on the skin can be a sign of liver disease. These veins are often found on the face and chest. They occur when blood flow to the liver is obstructed, causing pressure to build up in the veins. If you notice an increase in spider veins, especially on your upper body, it could be a sign that your liver is not processing blood effectively. Five, gynecomastia. Gynecomastia, or the development of breast tissue in men, can be linked to hormonal imbalances caused by liver disease. The liver plays a key role in regulating hormones, and when it's not functioning properly, it can lead to an increase in estrogen. If you or someone you know is experiencing this condition, it might be worth investigating liver health as a potential cause. Number six, swollen right foot. Swelling in the right foot can be a sign of liver problems. This happens because the liver is not able to produce enough proteins needed to regulate fluid balance in the body. If you notice persistent swelling in your right foot, it could indicate that your liver is not functioning as it should, leading to fluid retention. Seven, itchy hands, feet. Persistent itching in your hands and feet can be a symptom of liver disease. This itching is often caused by a buildup of bile salts in the body, which occurs when the liver is not processing bile properly. If you find yourself scratching your hands and feet frequently, it might be time to consider a liver function test. Eight, low thyroid. A low thyroid or hypothyroidism can be associated with fatty liver disease. The liver and thyroid are closely linked and problems with one can affect the other. If you have been diagnosed with a low thyroid and are experiencing other symptoms of liver disease, it could be a sign that your liver health needs attention. How to reverse fatty liver disease. Fatty liver disease can often be reversed with lifestyle changes. Diet changes, eat a healthy diet, focus on eating lots of fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and lean proteins. Avoid foods high in sugar, salt, and unhealthy fats. Avoid alcohol, Alcohol can worsen liver damage. If you have a fatty liver, it's best to avoid drinking alcohol completely. Control portion sizes. Eating smaller portions can help you maintain a healthy weight and reduce fat in your liver. Exercise regularly. Stay active. Aim for at least 30 minutes of moderate exercise most days of the week. Activities like walking, cycling, or swimming can help reduce liver fat. 
maintain a healthy weight, lose weight if needed. Losing even a small amount of weight can reduce the fat in your liver and improve your liver health. Risk factors for fatty liver disease. Certain factors can increase your risk of developing fatty liver disease. Obesity, being overweight or obese is a major risk factor. Type two diabetes, having diabetes can increase your risk. High cholesterol, high levels of fat in your blood can lead to fatty liver. Metabolic syndrome, a combination of high blood pressure, high blood sugar, excess body fat around the waist, and abnormal cholesterol levels. Certain medications, some drugs like corticosteroids and certain cancer drugs can increase the risk. Rapid weight loss, losing weight too quickly can lead to fat buildup in the liver. Diagnosis of fatty liver disease. To diagnose fatty liver disease, doctors use several methods. Blood tests, these can check for signs of liver inflammation and damage. Imaging tests, ultrasounds, CT scans, and MRI scans can show fat buildup in the liver. Liver biopsy, in some cases, a small sample of liver tissue is taken to check for fat, inflammation, and damage. Treatment of fatty liver disease. Treating fatty liver disease focuses on managing the underlying causes and reducing liver fat. Lifestyle changes, diet, exercise, and weight loss are key. Medications. There are no specific medications for fatty liver, but doctors might prescribe drugs to control conditions like diabetes, high cholesterol, and high blood pressure. Regular monitoring. Regular checkups with your doctor to monitor your liver health and manage any complications. Thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe to our channel to stay updated with more health tips and information. Help us reach our next milestone of 250 subscribers. Stay vigilant, stay informed, and most importantly, stay healthy. See you next time.